Okay, Melo Chapter 2 talks about Rahab hides the spies. And Joshua, the son of Nun, sent two men secretly from Shittah on the spies, going. Or, get, get, he, yeah, start over. <laughs> it says, And Joshua, the son of Nun, sent two men secretly from Shittah on the spies, saying, Go to the land, especially Jericho. And they went and came to the house of a prostitute whose name was Rahab and lodged there, and was told of the king of Jericho, Behold, men of Israel have come here tonight to search out the land. Then the king of Jericho sent to Rahab, saying, Bring out the men who have come to you, who entered uh, your house, for they have come to search out all the land. The woman had taken the two men and hidden them, and she said, Sure, the men came, came to me, but I did not know where they were from. And when the gate was about to be closed at dark, the men went out. I do not know where, they, where the men went. Pursue them quickly, for you will overtake them. But she had brought them up to the roof and hid them with, with the stalks of flax that she had laid in order um, on the roof. So the men pursued after them on the way to the, to the Jordan as far as the fords, and the gate was shut as soon as the pursuers had gone out. Before the men laid down, she came up to, the, to them on the roof and said, and said to the men, I know that the Lord has given you the land, and that the fear of you has fallen upon us, and that all inhabitants of the land melt away before you. For we have heard how the Lord dried up the water of the Red Sea before you when you came out of Egypt, and what you did to the two kings of the Amorites who were beyond the Jordan, to Sahan and to Og, whom you devoted to destruction. And as soon as we heard it, our hearts melted, and there was no spirit left in any man because of you. But Lord your God, he is God in the heavens above and on earth beneath. He is, of course, Jesus Christ, who is God. Now then, please swear to me by the Lord that as I have dealt kindly with you, you will also deal kindly with me, or with my father's house, and give me a sure sign that you will be sa that it, that you will save uh, alive my father and mother and my brothers and sisters and all who belong to them and de and deliver out and deliver our lives from death. And the man said to her, "I'll lie for yours even to death. And if you do not tell this business of ours, then the Lord gives us this land. We will deal kindly and faithfully with you." Then she let them down by a rope through the through the window. For her house was built into to the city wall, so that she lived in the wall. And she said to them, Go into the hills, or the pursuers will, will encounter you, and hide, three, and hide there three days until the pursuers have returned, and afterward you may go your way. The man said to her, We will be, we will be guiltless with respect to this oath of yours that you have made us swear. Behold, when we come into the land, you shall tie this scarlet cord in the window through which you let us down, and you shall gather unto your house your father and your mother, your brothers, and all your father's household. And if anyone goes out of the doors of your house into the street, his blood shall be on his own head, and we shall be guiltless. But if a hand is laid on anyone who is with you in the house, his blood shall be on our head. But if you tell this business of ours, then we shall be guiltless with respect to your oath that you have made us swear. And she said, According to your words, so, so be it. Then she sent them away, and they, and they departed. And she tied the scarlet cord in the window. They departed and went to the hills and remained there three days until the pursuers returned. The pursuers searched all along the way and found nothing. And the two, then the two men returned. They came down from the hills and passed over and passed over and came to Joshua, the son of Nun, and they told him all they all that had happened to them. And they said to Joshua, Truly the Lord has given all the land to our hand, and also all the inhabitants of the land melt away because of us. So that's chapter 2 and Joshua talks about Rahab hides the spies that's pretty much it um, so chapter 3 will be next be right back with that